Did you know when using the audio stream player in Godot, instead of just straight up dragging your audio file into the audio stream, instead what you can do is you can click on empty and click new audio stream randomizer, open it up, and you could basically add multiple audio streams to this and it will randomly choose which audio file to play. Moreover, what you can do is you can come to this random pitch property. Here we're using a sword swoosh and we can randomize the pitch of that. So a value of one means no variation, but if we do 1.1, it will randomize that pitch. So it randomizes it from point, uh, 1.1 to 0 0.9 when you do it this way, and you could tell that it's also randomizing it in the less than one direction because when we do it like this, you'll see that one was super fast but that one was definitely less than one. So yeah, this definitely can save you a lot of time because you don't need to do it through code.